What's going on everyone and welcome back to another episode of Today in Ace Combat. Today is October 22nd and back in 2010 the Akerson Hill incident aka Mission 8 Handful of Hope took place in Akerson Hill from Ace Combat 5. Ooh, that was a mouthful. Located on the north coast of Osea, the objective of this mission is very simple and clear. Protect Mother Goose 1 through the hills from all enemy forces. Mother Goose 1 is a C5 transport plane carrying precious cargo go quote unquote to north point an escort mission woohoo well, finally a response this is the ocean air force transport plane mother goose one we're flying to the neutral country of north point we have the transmitter set to minimum power please come in closer so we can hear ah i think this is you on our radar can you see us We'd like you to guide us to a safe passage corridor through the AA defenses. We're on a top secret mission and are not transmitting a valid friendly ID signal to the ground-based automatic defense systems. As a result, a friendly surface-to-air missile was mistakenly fired at us. We narrowly avoided a direct hit, but our radar system was destroyed and we can't fly a safe path through the AA system. Since the transport plane's ID signal hasn't registered in the AA system's database, the AA system fired at the plane. That's right, we have to take on our own defense system to protect them at all costs. The plane can't move around much and its radar system is broken. Just how awesome is that? You have to navigate the plane through the tiny circles on your radar in order to avoid any combat. And once it's through, you'll receive a mission update. Some enemy Yuktobanian aircraft enter the airspace and the transport plane begins to have some flight issues. Then you're given a very weird set of updates from the crew members. So there was a spy on the fucking plane and with two engines shut down and the pilot shot They make two random dudes try an emergency land this thing Tommy and uh, Mr. Cargo, huh? There's one issue the ground is full of electric generator windmills and you're ordered to clear a pathway for the transport plane to land You have to take these windmills out So my man Tommy who has never landed a plane before attempts to do so somehow some fucking way they do it. And you know, I wonder, I really wonder who this Mr. Cargo could be. Are you alright, Mr. Cargo? Uh, yeah, I guess. That was a pretty smooth ride, actually. Mr. Cargo, I've got a question I'd like to ask you. What is it? The Bird of Peace. Did you really have to use that beautiful white bird for this war? Do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. I wanted to see your... your bridge of peace span into outer space. It's still possible. Thanks to the bird, we're on even terms now. I'm trying to get to North Point, because I believe we have a chance. To hold talks in neutral territory. Right. Communication is vital. So I can still believe in you then. I don't want to see any more young men or women lose their lives. Me neither. Uh-oh, I'm out of fuel. This is the Ocean Air Force 8492nd Squadron. We observed the emergency landing on our radar. Can you see us? You can leave the rest to us. We'll provide support until the transport plane's crew is rescued. Roger, 8492nd. Take care of them for us. Sure thing. Okay, if you guys haven't figured out, that's right. It's the president. It's Mr. Harling. The 8492nd showed up and rescued the crew on board, and they leave it at that. Alrighty, everyone, that's going to be it for today's episode of Today in Ace Combat. I want to know in the comment section below, did you guys figure out that President Harling was in the C5 transport plane before you saw the ending cutscene, or did you just kind of try and, you know, oh, it's just a random pilot, Mr. Cargo, hello, sir. Clearly, it does make sense at the end of the cutscene that 
that, you know, well, the only guy that would negotiate peace talks with Yukta Bania is President Harling. It must be some important guy, right? If you guys haven't already, make sure to follow me on Instagram and Twitter and join the Discord. The links are in the description down below. And you should definitely subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's it. I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. I love you guys so much. Thank you all so much for watching today's video. And of course, as always, I will see you all in solitary.